There are 2 million farms in the United States. Each farm feeds 170 people worldwide every year. But setbacks such as severe weather or supply chain issues can stretch finances very thin. So this video shows you five ways to find grants for farmers, the latest news on USDA farm grants, and three pro tips for success with grants. I'll start with pro tip number one. Government agencies and private grant funders both consider two things equally important when it comes to grants. One, mission, and two, location. The mission is to see something grow or change in culture or in your fields and pastures. But their funds won't cover the globe, so grant funders select specific geographic locations to award these funds. These grant locations can be anywhere from national to regional, state, county, or town. But how do you find these grants? My answer is pro tip number two, online directories. Here is a private company called Ambrook that provides financial services for farms. They're not a sponsor. I just think that their free and comprehensive grants directory can be worth your time to search for grant options. You can search by state or territory, then finance type, then tags or specific categories, or you can search for a specific organization. And the USDA, also not a sponsor of this channel, maintains a list of small farm funding resources on this webpage. There is a helpful table of contents near the top, but it's still worth your time to click through a few listings to see how many links are provided here. And speaking of the USDA, what is the latest news on USDA farm grants? The USDA has three overarching initiatives, and each one has a web page that lists who is eligible, so you can quickly see if these are worth your time to pursue. One, diversifying the next generation of agriculture professionals, open only to higher education institutions. Two, bioproduct pilot program, bioproduct research facilities only. And three, open data network, Lots of organizations are eligible, but a primary role in this work is data, not supporting your farm. So where does that leave us? With my pro tip number three, start with local grants. You can start with the grant directory I shared earlier, USDA state offices, state departments of agriculture, your nearest extension office, and your nearest USDA local service centers. I hope you now have the tools and skills you need to find the grants that will work for you. I'm Tiffany, thank you for watching. See you in the next video.